press the slice button. It may look the same, but you are now looking at your sliced model. You will see some important information has shown up. Cura estimates your printer will take one hour and 26 minutes to print this model and utilize 12 grams of filament. Let's now press the preview button and have a look at how this model will print. Preview is a critical component of Cura, something you should become accustomed to utilizing extensively prior to saving your G-code and attempting to print a new model. Let's click it now. We are now looking at our model print. You'll notice up top, we are in the preview section. If you make any change at all from this point forward, you will have to re-slice this model. So we are not gonna to touch anything at all. We are simply going to preview the print process for this model. Down here, you will see a play slider. And over here, you will see a layer slider. We are going to click and hold on the top ball of this layer slider and bring it down. You are gonna see the models disappearing. What's happening is we are now looking at one individual layer. If you click and hold on the layer slider and start to pull up, you will see the layers forming one at a time. This is how the printer will go about printing your model. If you are wondering what the play button down here does, the play button will show the actual path that your printer will follow to print the current layer on the screen. What you're seeing now is the infill, and that pattern is the cubic pattern. So you can see that preview is an absolute critical component to 3D printing. Whenever you slice a file, you should not save the G-code or attempt to print that file unless you have carefully reviewed the preview of that file, how it's going to print, and feel confident that it is going to work out. Make a habit of previewing every change you make carefully before saving your file and sending it to your printer.